sign you got here? You know, I caught up with my friend, Pretty Ricky. Pretty Ricky, I told you about the guy all over the internet, blabbing his lips, looking for competition. Me? Me, baby. That's me. See, it's not often that I'm able to give you guys one of my daily doses of Stark's remarks, but lucky for you, you're in luck. See, a lot of times I'm pretty quiet and I don't say much and that's okay, but there's something I gotta get off my chest because it's been bothering me a lot lately, and that's dealing with B.O.W. It seems that B.O.W. is changing, the landscape is changing, and while I'm a fan of that and I am glad to be a part of that, there's a few things that I want rearranged. Lately, it's been happening with Carson where he's being screwed over with Rudy Russo and nothing's getting finished. But that's not on my agenda, that's okay. But lately, I have been losing due to circumstances beyond my control. Obviously, you're a witness to that. Am I right or am I wrong? And I'm always right, thank you. See, Basically, it's like this, and I'm going to be matter-of-factly with all of you people. I have to do something to prove to all of you people that I belong exactly where I am. B.O.W. needs me. You people want to see me. This works like a huge circle. Do you get where I'm going with this? Listen, hear me out. There is a guy by the name of Chris Marvel that I cannot stand, I absolutely detest. Not more so than Rudy Russo, mind you, but those two, they're in conjunction, so you might as well hate them evenly. What I'm getting at is this. Chris Marvel is a man of many talents. He has experience far beyond me, and since I am still new, I may be a little bit naive in thinking that I can beat him. No, actually, it's not naiveness. It's smart. It's knowing from right here that I can beat you, Chris Marvel, any time of day. I can beat you on your best day, but you can never beat me on my worst. He has wrestled many people, many top great athletes. He's been around the world, but that doesn't mean anything because look where he's at in B.O.W. So really, are you that good, Chris Marvel? Or are you just con are you complacent and you're stagnant and you're just coasting by in limbo? waiting for something to happen, huh? I don't think you, I don't think you understand exactly where I'm coming from. So I want to do this for you. Chris Marvel, August 18th, my friend, if the power is that be, watch this video, understand that I need this more than I need sex. <laughs> Let's be honest, that's not true. But what is true is I need this more than I need to wrestle somebody Joe Schmo. I don't need to waste my time with that. What I need is a match with Chris Marvel to prove to everybody exactly where I come from, where I stand, the talents that I have, and exactly why I belong in B.O.W. Branded Outlaw Wrestling wouldn't be the same without me. Really. I think, uh, I think next time you guys see me, which is August 18th, same time, Woodland Gym Center, I think you guys are going to see a different Ricky Starks. Pretty Ricky Starks. Yeah, he's cool right now, but uh, I'm going to take it a step further. Yeah, you tell Chris Marvel personally that I'm coming for his ass. And I want to prove something. If you don't know what that is, then I guess you're just out of luck in knowing that, huh? It's nice talking to you, buddy.